Good morning, good morning. How's everybody doing this Saturday morning? I'm doing just fine. Just gonna fill out my logbook here real quickly. And then we'll be on our way. Just uh, had breakfast over here at the Petro Truck Stop in uh, Yorkton, uh, Saskatchewan. Yeah, just down the road from here, I uh, switched trailers from my empty uh, to this loaded trailer. Went over to the scale and scaled it and everything. Now we are good to go. Here we go. It's about uh, 530 kilometers to get home. So uh, that should take us about six hours driving time. So we got nine o'clock central time right now. That'll be 10, 11, 12, 1, 2. Yeah, about three o'clock we should be uh, we should be rolling into Steinbach. That's still early enough, so I, will, I should have a good weekend. At least I hope I will have a good weekend. Uh, you know, these Canadian parking spots are always dirt lots. Well, almost always, not always, but almost always. Bumpy. But yeah, it was snowing a little bit earlier when I started driving this morning. As you guys probably remember from yesterday's video. I was in Saskatoon overnight, so it took me uh, about three and a half hours to get over here. But we got everything done now. We are rolling. Everything has worked out so far the way I wanted it, so I'm happy about that. And we'll be home for the weekend. I made myself available for Monday morning. Go out Monday morning. Hopefully get ourselves a reload again. And hopefully it'll be a good decent load again like we had this time. I mean I can't complain one little bit. It was a nice trip. For 228 kilometers. I got uh, yeah, 10,355 kilometers in right now on, on total on this trip. So that's probably about 6,600 miles or something like that. So that's, that's some good miles. I'm really, really happy about that. That's a two weeks drive. But uh, yeah, so uh, we'll keep on rolling. We'll see what the day will bring us. See what kind of interesting things we have happening today or what's going to go on today. I know uh, last week Saturday was quite a bit of an interesting day. So that video you guys are probably watching today you will be watching this video in a week from today so unless you choose not to watch it then i guess not but hey i hope all of you guys enjoy my videos and like to watch every one of them but i certainly know not every one of them is going to be the same interest or whatever you know but uh, at least i try and make it as interesting as i possibly can we just stopped for a little bit of a pit stop up here in Manadosa rest area. That's Manitoba already. Yeah, we are in my home province. At least that uh, I call home. So we got about three hours to drive and then we'll be home. Home sweet home. So that'll be, uh, I'll be good. I'll be happy once I get home. I've been on the road for so long, I'm sort of getting tired of driving. I need a break, that's for sure. We'll get it. We'll get it. Yeah, anyways, we'll put the hammer down, get home as soon as we can, and we'll see what the family all has to say. In 300 meters, turn left on. Trans Canada Highway, Highway 16, and then keep to the right in 120 meters. Certainly do miss the wife and kids, you know. So I'll go see Trans them, left on. you know. Trans Canada Highway, Highway 16, but, and then uh, yeah, keep we'll to the right in 120 we'll meters. Weekend. I, I really don't have any plans for the weekend, really, because. Uh, I've been a 
away for such a long time I don't really didn't really make any plans for the weekend I haven't invited anybody or nothing yet so I don't know if I will I, I don't know I haven't like I've been gone for almost two weeks now I think I'll spend the little time that I have with the wife and kids instead of with friends you know so to the right on Trans Canada Highway Highway 10 but we'll see we'll see what we'll do I wouldn't be one little bit surprised if somebody's gonna call hey you know let's do something or come over for barbecue or something continue on this road for six kilometers yeah well if that happens it happens but I don't know, we'll see what the wife wants. If she wants to invite anybody, then we'll do it. But we'll be depending on that, so... Anyways, as you can see, it's nice sunny up here, so uh, that's good. At least no more snow. We have finally made it to our Steinbach terminal. Drop the trailer finished doing all my paperwork and uh, got my pay stub in the mail and everything like that and I also had another envelope in there and uh, discovered that they gave us a new card now we can fuel up at the Fly and J Shell up here in Canada until now we were never able to do that so uh, supposedly I guess we'll get better deals up there than at the Husky so we'll no longer be able to fuel at the Huskies at least that's what it sounds like, but uh, hey, that's fine by me. I like the Flying J anyways better than the, than the Huskies. The Huskies don't have very good showers. They're not terrible, uh, some of them, but some of them are horrible. But uh, yeah, I'm real happy about that, excited. We'll see what the future will bring us. And uh, yeah, so now I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna drop off my uh, clothes and stuff like that, and then I'll pick up my son. I'll go uh, wash the truck yet. All right, we just finished washing the truck. Going down Main Street and looking at the beautiful uh, Christmas trees that they got up and running already. But uh, yeah, a little bit of a stretch, a little bit of driving yet till we're home. But uh, just figured I'd show you guys this and probably I'm gonna end it with this. Enjoy it while it lasts, I guess, is the word. And now we'll be back again tomorrow at 5 a.m. So thanks for watching.